Hello everybody, welcome to the Rebel Roundup. Now unfortunately this week I haven't had time to look at all the all the matches, do all the highlights, you know it takes a long time and I've been super busy with the World Cup. So for this episode, just gonna and probably next episode, just have a look at my game in full and then a quick roundup of the rest of the games. And then taking a bribe there, dirty Dino, scumming a scumming a bribe. Bit uh <laughs> Right. Hello, everybody. Welcome to match day two of season nine, Rebel Division Four. I should have, uh, I should have closed the window here because, uh, of course, some fucking German guy is choosing this moment to mow his lawn. Um, I right, got loads of loads of block. Beast man, isn't that, isn't that good? It's not. It is a defensive skill. Is it worth putting them on the LOS, or is it better to put skillless guys on the LOS? Fifty-five percent knockdowns versus seventy-five percent knockdowns. Should have won the toss. So that was stupid of me. Uh, silly mistake, not winning the toss. Um, he's got block. My blow, block my blow. Claw. I really don't know what to do. They're both close to a second level, it's particularly MDK. Um, the result doesn't really matter. So, I, I could almost just bench my good players. <laughs> I could always just literally bench my three claw guys and just not even care this hard. Um, Two zero SPP guys on the other ones. Don't pussy out, pussy out like a balls. Um, I could have the eleven one on the pitch, I guess, because he's quite good. And then he's on 13, then he can pick up the ball and get his second skill. Okay, I'm kind of getting too many skilled up beastmen here. So I guess losing one wouldn't be wouldn't be bad really, would it? In fact, losing the 13 guy wouldn't be bad. Because he's only got block. So actually... Let's have a go. Oh Pedro, it's in it's in the Discord um, when I'm playing my World Cup match, um, and it's on my Google Calendar, which I don't know how to share, but um, I am playing as a gal at fifteen thirty UTC on Wednesday. Um, I'll be casting some of the other games as well, seeing as I've got them all. Seeing as I have all the information of when they are, I will be casting a lot of the World Cup games. Um, I will do my best not to not to talk tactics in them because you know, even though obviously they're 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 all good coaches, you could spot something that they haven't spotted. No matter, you know. So I'll try not to talk tactics in them to spoil them. I'll maybe just put the stream on a delay almost. Um, not sure what to do about that. Repeat the time, 15.30 UTC on Wednesday. 15.30 UTC, so 5.30 for myself. <laughs> Maddo. Good old Maddo. And he's good, he's still, oh look, the block, the block saved him. The block saved him from maybe his death. So that was good. Good, good block mans. <laughs> Murder kill. <laughs> he does have a claw mighty blow blitz coming in though. Now this is the, this is the this is the problem is you just can't you can't stop it can you and like I mean yes a rookie a rookie bloody snotling could cas you. But it's much more likely that uh, 
<laughs> that, a, that a claw mighty blow guy causes you, isn't it? And yeah, pretty scary. Every 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 hit is gonna be scary for sure. Oh man, I, f I forgot I forgot about this from the first game. <laughs> infinite infinite passing. About <laughs> about to happen. Fair enough. Fair enough. Leveling up is the most important is the most important thing in the game. I was going to protect him. Oh. <laughs> Got a stun on my defensive turn one. <laughs> Out bashing the opponent on turn one. Glorious. Um, right, he could, could blitz him. Get a claw pump hit. I'm, I'm tempted to just go around here and kind of play it safe. Ah, see the push. I anticipated the gym pals. Anticipated those. Ah, I didn't anticipate those ones though. Should have moved him first, probably. Stay down over there. Classic gym turn, wasn't it? Yeah. Mighty blow. Mighty blow pushes into a three dice claw palm hit. <laughs> Just getting more pushes. <laughs> Classic. But hey, outbashed out bashed on defense on the turn, first turn, which was funny, wasn't it? Why not his killer? Yeah, I would have only pushed and I couldn't pile on. If I'd if I'd hit him, I would have had to hit without without with this guy, couldn't I? I could have hit him. And then I would have pushed him to there, I would have had to pile on, or, or run him back. And then, so it would just been a claw mighty, this way I could have piled on, or it would be armor eight with mighty blow. And I couldn't pile on because he did got gang fire. So, um, yeah, just rebel, rebel right now. <laughs> British team already <laughs> queuing up. <laughs> it was great, the queuing up for the corners in the World Cup, I enjoyed that. That was very British. Or English, in fact. Thanks, puppy. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. And where, ne where next are we? So, Orcs, Orcs is going to be tough, so I guess having piling on makes the Orc matchup better. Whereas Block would have just been reliable and unexciting, isn't it? Whereas piling on gives you a chance to get lucky and win the game. I was quite safe from the claw this, this turn. Quite safe, but... Near the GFI anyway. It's a removal. Guess I should have not put him there. I should have put him here and then put him back one. Are these two back. These two could have gone back one. An Officerus Rex, almost a year now, Jimmer. Anything planned for our anniversary? <laughs> Thanks very much, Noffer, for staying fantastic. 
Um, yeah, no, unfortunately, I haven't got anything planned for anybody. But um, thank you very much for staying fantastic. Three, four, five, six, J five. Two, two dodges to hit the ball and two dice. Seems crap. Um, planning on here and then swarming him. Could be a thing. Leave Blitz round there. Again, into into another hit. Nah, let's go here. Another push. Go on me. Really, I, I don't know what happened the first game. Um, yeah, that was some... That was some fucked up bullshit, wasn't it, the first game? Actually out bashing somebody with a Kill Chaos team. Um, something went clearly very wrong that game. Him as well. World Cup matches. Um, well, yeah, you have to watch the replays, but um, then the the official casts are only happening on uh, for the semi-finals and the finals. I will be doing my best to. Um, to cast as many as I can, for sure. Um, so far, we've got Winteros versus Zola at 7, 1900 UTC tomorrow, um, and Sprinter versus Bud Tugley at 1930 UTC tomorrow. So, um, you know, I guess I, I could do that's 9 pm for me, so I guess I could do the Winteros versus Zola one, stuff like that. So, um, I'll try, I'll try to do that. Yeah, I did give him a target for the claw mighty goal there, but it was my least good player, wasn't it? So I didn't hate it. All right, is that eighteen thirty UTC? versus knee proxy. Mine's at Wednesday at 15.30 UTC, so that's good, isn't it? Yeah, there's only like 12 woodies, yeah, 15 humans. I mean, humans really benefited from the rule the rule set. Absolutely. So I could use the guard to get a claw pom hit, but then again, I'm getting gang fouled, aren't I? So that seems remarkably stupid. And hit him. Oh, fuck it. I can't stand this shit anymore. I can't take it no more. We finally get a knockdown, turn three. And what is it? Fucking nothing. Get in. All right, we got the kill chaos now. We got him. We got him right where we want him, lads, boys, lads. The kill chaos is fucking kicking off. 
brutality. Unmatched brutality this game. Outrageous stuff. <laughs> Fuck about. <laughs> yeah, Tony. It's, they killed last game. Last game, I made seven cars against the Woodies. So, so they can sometimes. It has been known for them to kill the odd game. <laughs> oh good, finally the dirty player is going to get sent off. Oh, no. no, that only happens. That only happens to me. <laughs> Thoroughly outbashed. Uh, with the absolute kill chaos team. Let's open the turn with another push, of course. This is like uh, the Phantom Menace, where you can only, you know, the menace, the menace must remain phantom. Whatever you do, don't hurt your opponent. You can never be too careful. <laughs> oh, fuck it, man. Oh, I moved him. Uh. Moved him into the warrior. Fucking game fucking me as usual. There's a reason. There's a reason Jim Powell's an emote, isn't there? <laughs> There's a reason that I used fucking used fucking wood owls, eh, in the World Cup. Right. Yeah, I couldn't make anything else. I couldn't. Nah, I guess I could have run him to here, couldn't I? I guess I could have run him back to there. All the fixtures are done for the World Cup, World King. Um, you can do exclamation point World Cup. Ex well, WC. There you go. <laughs> Brilliant move there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good point for Fan Fox. Yeah, I'm just going to surf this guy. Yeah, at least he roll pushes anyway. That's something.
<laughs> Dirty player right where his killer is. <laughs> very, very subtle positioning there. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. <laughs> right, one, two, three, four, five, GFI. So I don't want to expose him to a blitz from him, but then he could just blitz him. Oh, I can't get the assist in there unless I blitz him. We don't even know why I bother making blocks at all. I'm just going to one dice over there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is a stupid fucking game. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that makes sense, doesn't it? It does look that way, doesn't it? To be honest, it does look that way. Right, the guard can stand up to give that a two D. <laughs> yeah, true, try. I feel like Bernie will... I, I don't know, Bernie was really fast to commit to a sideline, and if he does that, he'll get punished, won't he, against, uh, against witch elves and stuff. He's got the dirty player there. what we need. We'll fit and push this guy for the surf. <laughs> it worked. <laughs> oh, got a stone. Fucking go me. Hmm. Hard to get assists on the foul now, isn't it? 
It's all I care about. <laughs> Um, in tabletop in Pro Augustus, you can just you can just surf them, and you shouldn't be able to surf them. You need you need all the luck, Will King. I mean, if you if you think about it, if you think if you think about it, right? Even if you've got a god of Blood Bowl who would have a 66% win rate versus all the other good players in the World Cup. Which um, which I really don't think anybody would have a 66% chance of winning every single game. Um, but you know, that's like a three plus ensemble, isn't it? You've got to win six of those, which puts you at 8.8%. So even even like a fucking god of Blood Bowl would have a very low chance to win the World Cup. So it's absolutely just gonna be the luckiest person wins for sure. Yes, which got my first game is uh, is on when well first and probably last game is on Wednesday um, at fifteen thirty UTC. <laughs> Let's try. Not fouling because he wants to protect the ball. <laughs> what a fucking noob. <laughs> what, a, what a fucking noob. Thinking, thinking I'm going to give a fuck about the ball. <laughs> Only joking, of course, before anyone takes offence. Yep, exactly, Imperator Augustus, yeah. Um, oh, I don't know, it's on, it's on somebody's... It's on a Zungo's fucking Dropbox or something. <laughs> but anyway, I don't, I don't want to talk about it anyway because I just want to ignore him. I just want to ignore the fact that he exists. <laughs> to be honest. Stops me, stops the serve. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Fuck off. Fuck off. Oh, my God. Neither did I, I was just focused on the one mighty blow claw guy who's, who's removed half my team by himself. <laughs> well, the good thing is he's going to score and give us a chance to, uh, to get three LOS hits in. So that's good, isn't it? Oh, I've just thought of this. What can I do here? Oh, shit. <sighs> I'm going to punch him there and then don't follow. And I've got four plus to hit the ball, haven't I? But I can't surf him. Should have thought more. Should have thought more that about that. There we go. The one dice powers. That's all I needed. 
I should have thought more of it this time. There's four minutes I didn't even realise. It's only one of them got him up yet. The moment we've waited the whole game for, it's a fucking push! Yeah! Super guy! <sighs> yeah, I probably should have uh, probably should have thought there, shouldn't I, about pushing that guy into there and then doing something. Yeah, I did push I did screw that up myself. But I still did get a claw pom hit on his mighty god. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby. And try I mean, he's rolled a better. bunch of pushes as well. So that's that's good. It's not like it's completely one-sided. It's, on, it's only three KOs. And I haven't really tried to stop. I was going to surf the ball carrier. Um, but couldn't. <laughs> couldn't surf the ball carrier because of the fucking leap. Twelve players. <laughs> wow, I'm so shocked at the non greed there. I mean, obviously punished on one of thirty six, but a claw hit on my on a claw pin. Might have been worth it. Yeah, I did screw that one up. I should have really thought about getting a chain to do something. Because <laughs> uh, he's an absolute man when Lemon is good. He's an absolute man. <laughs> Don't try to one turn Lemon with pushes. That's, that's, when, I, that's when I'll get the pals like. <laughs> the thing is, though, it's. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> he does it, he gets the completion. <laughs> oh man. No oh, well, mostly came back. All right, three blocks. Are you ready? Are you ready for the most violent blocks you've seen in your life? <laughs> the biggest LOS hit anyone has ever seen. I'm ready. Maybe a, maybe a riot as well. Riot for the win would be good. Cheeky chant. Oh, he's got a... Throw a rock and get the ref band, or have I got that? I might. I'm, that might be my. That might be my one. Um, right, somebody who needs one. Anybody? You could go uh, twenty-five and then be two touchdowns away. Or three cars.
One Valiant and two stuns, I'd be happy with that. There's the stun. Oh, the, the send-off is a given. The send-off is an absolute sheer given. Got another stun coming up. Stun, brilliant. Three stuns. Three stuns and a send off. That's what it's looking like. KO'd. All right, I guess I can't. I well, might as well, because the KO doesn't matter, does it? Catch it, you little cunt. Good. Go there and foul him. Insta, insta send off, no EV break. Classic, absolute classic gym foul. Literally no other outcome. This season, I've made five. I've made five uh, fouls in total, and rolled um, seven, eight, eight doubles. Eight doubles on five fouls. <laughs> Matto, it's I've got two reserves, and it was a rookie goal. So yeah, that's one time. And it's turn eight, so a stun guy is the same as a non stun guy. So, yes, it wasn't a real match, was it? I wasn't falling for position or anything. But anyway, I mean, I know you're screaming there in capitals, but I don't know why. Um, right, thank you very much, Eddie2112. Thanks, uh, thanks for staying fantastic. Glorious. Thank you very much. Right, eat this guy's on. Thirteen. Right. Um, Thanks for a classic J I M M G A M E. Have a double one donation. <laughs> Glorious. Thanks, Azungo. Um, yeah, he explained. He literally explained that he wanted a push to get a chain surf uh, so that he could chain surf the other one. Um, so it's just really obvious if you, if you, if you, if you, it's really obvious if you, if you're good at Blood Bowl. Um, so I could, I could do a video explaining it if you want, but, um, yeah, that was just really, really bad. Really bad. Um, is that today? No, eh? It's, it's after 1100 UTC. Oh, do you mean 23 UTC? That's too late for me, Gadena. Oh, tomorrow. When, when are you playing Gadena? 
Um, Saturday. All right. Right. Let's. Uh, let, I'll just put that on the thing. I'll put that on my calendar. I've got a calendar. Um, Eleven UTC was it? So for me, that's one. And it's Kaday Nick versus literally already forgotten uh, Wolfbar. I really need to work out how to share my calendar because it's got all of the. It's going to have all of the games that have been announced as scheduled on. Um, right, what I think I want is I think I want the guard there. So I can just three dice well. And then blitz him. I don't even know. Oh no, then he can go there and then he can go there and then. Alright, fuck it, this'll do. 13. He can get a touchdown if, if it matters. Hey, caught the ball. Got an extra reroll. Hey, a Kaz. All right. <laughs> Turn nine, we got a removal. All right. All right, all right, all right. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Defenseless edge four player here. <laughs> let's, let's greed it. Do nothing. I was a fucking really, really fucking stupid breed, wasn't it? Here I was thinking that I could fucking break armor. <laughs> it is first blood, isn't it? Chaos, mighty blow, claw. A mighty blow and a claw guy versus two mighty blow guys, a claw mighty blow guy, and two claw pom guys. And the first Kaz is on turn nine from either side. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, that's ridiculous, isn't it? I, I pretty much got off lightly, only taking three kills, really. Three, nine, so it is down to ten. If that, if, oh, he stayed out. So if I'd got, if I'd got a Kaora Kaz on the foul, would have been up two players now. <laughs> you did it, Jim. You injured a player after nine turns off claw pom hits. Yeah, and several three dice blocks as well. Thanks, Noridam. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Glorious. Yeah, I get the leap. I completely forgot about the leap. I've got to keep an eye on this warrior who could who could leap into the cage, haven't I? I really do have to keep an eye on that. Ridiculously. <laughs> Ridiculously have to keep an eye on that. <laughs> oh shit. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine.
And I can't get them all in anyway. <laughs> Even players. About to be down, man. For this block. Mm. Yeah, to be fair, it's a sweet move with the leap, the leap warrior to get the uh, to get the touchdown. And a really good chance of surfing. again. And I'll send off of course. Pushes. Good. Just what we need. I tried the running game. The running game comment was after I won like fucking 3 1 or something. That was the funniest thing. Or, or 4 0 or something. I won 4 0 or 4 1 or something. And some guy was like. <laughs> some guy was like, should have tried the running game. <laughs> it's like. You fucking idiot. How much do you want me to win by? <laughs> Brilliant. I mean, I hope no one's thinking that I'm moaning all the time here. I mean, I know it's a, it, it could come across as a bit moany, but it's just it's just funny just getting, you know. Every, like, the first game against the Wood Elves, I got loads of cards. This game, done absolutely nothing. And uh, taken five KOs. And a send-off on the one and only foul that I did. <laughs> well, um, yeah, for some reason, yeah, and I don't like listening to people moan about the dice all game. You know, so I don't, I don't want to do it. I don't, you know, I'm not really moaning. Like no one's died, so there's nothing to. That's that's the most important thing, isn't it? Is nobody dying at the end of the day. Um, not winning or anything doesn't really matter too much. So. Oh, 
Aegis. Unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> oh, you can't really needed a push there. Really fucking needed a push there. I didn't forget about leave, that's why that's why the ball is where it is. Cause he could have just left surf me, couldn't he, if I'd uh, if I'd gone near the sideline where I wanted to go. Well I mean I really just wanted to fucking push this guy. So I could have caged up there and stuff, but Oh backyard door door. Wow, what a frustrating game. Chaos, never breaking armor is. Is not such a good team. Well, it, it's not crazy, is it? I mean, that is, that is the weakness of. Uh, that that is the weakness of chaos, isn't it? You know, you're putting your eggs in the basket of. I'm taking all these kill skills, I'd better I'd better roll some kills and really with dice he can do it with claw mighty blow, can't he? You know, although, although I'm making three dice claw bomb blitzers and he's making two dice claw mighty blow hits. He can still just roll the dice and out cast me, so could do the same with mighty blow. One mighty blow could do the same. I got out bashed I got out bashed by Inarian, didn't I, in that in that uh in that Um Oh yeah, good. He does he does the leap. Oh no, he doesn't he does the leap to just hit this guy. Was it a leap? It was a leap to hit the marking card. Um Yeah, I got I got out bashed by Narian in the in the semi that I got to in the champs ladder and he just had like a tree and a mighty blow dancer. It can happen, can't it? Any any anyone can get out bashed in football. It doesn't matter a whole lot, this kill skills that you've got. Not consistently, it's got a fire on the day, hasn't it? Yeah, disappointing. Disappointing foul on it. He could have done, but he, this way he gets the dirty fair foul on the claw point. Though majestically, he doesn't get killed. He can 2D, if this is a POW, it's pretty good. Or he could just do that for a push and move some people. He could blitz him. Um, I'd need, either need the second assist or to GFI that assist. I think GFI and the assist is easier. He stands up, he blitzes him, pushes him to there, <laughs> and then see what happens. Didn't push him. Okay, hold him. Outrageous. Right, this. I could, cause I could go one, two, three, double GFI to then get a 
2D block on him. But he could just push him and then bring him into 2D him. But the problem is then this asshole. I think that's the safer play, isn't it? Shit, I got the plan. Yes! Good. Good! Right. Okay, finally getting some removals now, and uh, could be okay. Big SVP game, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the main threat gone. That's the key thing, isn't it? Is getting getting the hits. His, if his claw mighty blow could have got to hit my claw bombs, and my claw bombs could get his hit, claw, hit his claw mighty blows, and I did get two claw bomb hits on his claw mighty blow. So happy about that. Huge foul, but only on a block die. That looks like he's given up on stopping the score, which is good. The wall, at least. Bribe's gone. <laughs> how much how much bashiness do I have? These have been cars I could score and go for the win, I think. But um not not even that many men up at the moment. I could pom him. Yeah. Glorious. Thank you very much, Vala Hoppier. The king of humans. It wasn't a brave pile on, was it? It was a brave blitz, basically. If I'd blitz and didn't pile on, I would have just got blitzed by claw and then fouled. So, you know, it doesn't really... Yeah, he gets the chain away. Another removal. All the way, Vibre, if he assists. I could have blitzed the dirty player with a GFI. Maybe I should have done that. Stunned. <laughs> 
Tu. I literally don't understand how he didn't die. <laughs> You could GFI to hit the dirty player. You could blitz him, chain him out, and stick him on a guy. Problem with him blitzing is I need to stick somebody there. This is GFI. Considering I put him out. <laughs> Did Flat Fire get a Kaz this game? No, it was a. Uh, it was. ID crow. No, it wasn't. I don't know. It's a random guy to the cat. Oh, it was the strength guy to the cat. Yeah, I did bring more back to the ball, though, didn't I? Right, 1 in 81. <laughs> um. Losing doesn't doesn't even matter. So don't have a don't have a could have two assists there. Uh, but then can he would just go four five speed up to four. So just two D. Hit his edge guy because I quite want him to have core and hurt other people. But then what if he plays me? I mean, I'm not playing him for the rest of the season. I don't really want to hurt his team. It's just if I get a cast, isn't it? I guess getting Claude... Yeah, no, I don't know. No, I guess Claude protects my team in the long run. And in fact, for the three LOS books. Skull, skull, skull. <laughs> Hi. So the 16 point guy can now uh, retreat to the safety of the back line. Mostly defenseless guys. He wants to score on one turn or he can. 
Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed works. Yeah, it is better to, to, to lose than... Yeah, it is actually better to lose, but I, I just fucking hate it. I just fucking hate losing. <laughs> I fucking hate losing. I mean, I would have... If he hadn't made the... If he hadn't made the warrior foul, I would have totally gone for the surf on the carrier to try to win. Because I just can't help wanting to win. Um, but yeah, a draw with nobody dying. Touch wood is fine, isn't it? Tier one, there were tiers try, there were tiers, and uh, the tier one team got four normals, and the tier two got five normals and a double, so it meant that humans outclassed all of the tier one bash teams early on. Um, so there you go. Yeah, no one died yet. Yeah, no one died yet. Well, no one of importance died anyway, even if all three of these died, it's not the end of the world. No one of importance died. He, even, how nasty is that? I mean, this was bad play as well by him. He gets his block guy on a guy without block. It's his block claw mighty blows. It was just nasty trying to get rid of my best player. Rather well, than giving himself the best odds to get a card with claw mighty blow. Nasty man. Nasty man. Um, glorious, thank you very much, Svaha. Welcome back to Team Fantastic. Thank you very much. I am... Um, I am back to Blood Bowl now, 100%. Rocking the Blood Bowl. Thanks very much. Glorious. <laughs> yeah, if Brett were tier two, I think Brett would have been one of the premier choices for sure if they'd been tier two. What would have been good would have been like a tier 1.5. I hate that as well, by the way, in things. Just have tier one. You don't need tier one, 1 1.5 and tier two. Have tier one, two and three, for fuck's sake. It's not, it's not fucking... It's not fucking rocket science. I fucking hate it. They do it all the time as well. Just, just renumber them. <laughs> What's wrong with fucking integers? Holy shit. Um, I do know that I've got the highest win record with Bretton CZL, but you know it doesn't it doesn't mean anything, does it? Just got lucky. Um, right, seventeen AV rates in total, which is uh, which was something, wasn't it? Oh, he got on his way to fifty one. That's good. He leveled, which is good for him. And uh, yeah, five kills and a Kaz seven kills. Very, very pillow fisted, really. Both teams. Um, I was, <laughs> I was confused as well to why I couldn't re-roll then on the wings. <laughs> Just assumed that one. Um, <laughs> right. And there was a level up, wasn't there? Zero perms. The only one Kaz in the entire game. <laughs> That's so stupid. <laughs> movement. Oh, he could be the carrier with movement. Like, I would have preferred agility or, or strength, but uh, he can be movement and be the carrier, so that's good. Finally got finally got a ball carrier after, uh, after 16 games. Got a basic ball carrier. So that, that's something, isn't so, it? So, yeah, a, ba a bad week for flat fat. <laughs> but, you know, it's okay, isn't it? Draws draws are okay. Um, I, I absolutely hate not winning, but I'm aware that it's it's not the end of the world not to. Um, so let's have a look at the other games and the table. So first up, we've got Keji Roos versus Hindi. And we've got, uh, you know, Necro versus Lizards. Looks like... Looks like a comfortable win, really, for the Lizards, to be honest. Looking at the 68% ball possession. Um, more blocks. Only slightly outbashed. So it looks like the claw didn't take over the game, as it sometimes does. Fair bit of uh, SPP. If we look at the block dice, we've got 24, 27, 24, which is... Ah, the 14 is all right, but still not super exciting, is it? And then if we go with the Lizards, we've got 33, 23, 42. So that's a lot of pals. Um, so I guess that helped him. And um, 
Yeah, you know, you got more blocks. It, I'm really sorry that I didn't have time to look at all the replays. So this is, you know, it's not very in depth, is it? But there you go. And now I see the Meme Land Bashers, coached by Ramhard, uh, Chaos Dwarves, versus Lizards from Dimension X, coached by Gren Drake. Battle to a 1 1 draw. The Croxigors had something happen to him. <laughs> 16 AV breaks to 8, um, two, two explosions, you know, not not surprising, he's fouling, 1-1 one, one draw. I mean, I think there's going to be a lot of draws in this division as as teams don't want to risk pushing for a win, do they? Because a lot of the teams are very violent, 48 blocks to 30, 5 KOs, 3 Kaz. A really hard, hard bashing there from the, the Meme Land bashers. And uh, got a few SPPs. And wow, twenty-eight J five. That's that's impressive, isn't it? <laughs> and what's that? Forty, thirty-one, thirty-three. So not actually very good dice overall. Loads of skulls. And then twenty-one, fifteen, twenty-four. So kind of good bash dice there as well. You know what can I say? On, on, 62 37 ball possession it's really it's really hard to, to guess anything from the stats isn't it but there you go 1-1 one, one with that match now another crazy result here from tumbling dice um orcs of letters orc team coached by puppy versus tumbling dice wood elf team coached by the coach um it's not it's it's well it's crazy that that puppy's lost his first two games because he's got an amazing team but to be fair he's lost to my pre-season favourite to win the division because it's got such a solid Lizardman team uh, in Hindi and you know the tumbling dice I always, I said were probably the best team at winning it's whether they can keep their team alive so he's probably got his two hardest games out of the way made 16 AV breaks but you know if you don't kill all of the elves it's not enough he did really good though getting 10 removals from 31 blocks but there you go if the elves if the elves did some things they're going to win aren't they 23, 21, 31, so good dice. 12, 16, 16, so hardly any dice there. He probably made more dodges. 44 dodges, poor dodges, but still won 3 2. So, fair play, fair play to the coach there. Well done. Next up, we have Buford T. Justice's Crematorium crew overcoming the uh, necromantic uh, undead team, actually. Overcoming the 16 turns of headache that anyone faces when playing Dwarves, coached by Skulls. And uh, yeah, 1 0 is impressive, isn't it? Only 9 AV breaks for 13. Um, 50 31, 46 out blocked, out bashed, and somehow got the 1 0 win. So I don't know if they were crazy, crazy dice to save it or what. Or just, just sheer good play. I'll never know because unfortunately the World Cup took too much time. But 33, 35, 30 doesn't seem crazy. Block dice. Uh, GFI is not crazy. Dodge is poor. So looking like sheer good play, isn't it? Um, seven dodges for the dwarves. 14. They've had, the fact they've had to try 14 GFIs. Four pickups. So uh, what's that? 41, 24. 40. So he didn't roll many pushes, but he rolled a lot of skulls. But a lot of powers as well. Uh, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 rerolls on fail blocks is quite a lot. Especially for dwarves, isn't it? But um, no, all credit would be for T Justice, I guess. I guess. <laughs> That's all I can do. I, once, I can only apologise. Holy Boy versus Muppetillo here, 2-2, two, two. They, they, they got a bit crazy, didn't they? Uh, more AV breaks for the Necro and the Lizards. And uh, a lot more blocks though, 45 to 36, maybe Claw, Claw got him into this. 62 to 37 ball possession. Interesting. And uh, yeah, I guess 21, 33, 38, so very good dice. 20, 21, 33, 38 is a hell of a ratio, isn't it? And then 24, 30, 20. Poor dice, actually, from um, from Upper Tillow there. So maybe he feels a bit robbed. My guess is as good as yours. 
<laughs> so there's the schedule for the week. Um, as you can see, the Wolverine Wraiths picked up the admin win um, because the guy who quit and mine was a 1-1 draw with Rasta's Chaos. Um, so yeah, let's have a look at the table. And unfortunately, because of the the admin win, um, I, I didn't get Wayne Farah and Rasta played each other before I could take a screenshot of the table because you know it, it, it's done it's done when they roll the week unfortunately the admin win so I wasn't able to get a screenshot when there was only two games played by everybody but unsurprisingly Hindi at the top uh, the coach again unsurprisingly uh, Puppy being at the bottom although it's a bit crazy I'm sure it's gonna it's, he's gonna storm back up the table because he's got his two hardest games out of the way so um, everything else, as you'd expect, a fair amount of draws, bash mirrors, nobody wanting to get hit by claw, you know, nobody really pushing for the win too hard. Um, but you know, it's it's early days yet. Right, thanks for watching, everybody. Hopefully you enjoyed that, and I know it was a bit lame not looking around the league at all of the games. I really think that's a great idea. Um, it prob I probably won't be able to do it next week either. But after the World Cup dies down, because you know there's so many games, 32 games in the first week, 16 games in the second week, and it's really taken all of my time to just try and keep up with it. Um, so, but it'll be, I'll be, you know, next week I'll show all my game, and then hopefully week four we can start seeing, you know, all of the uh, all of the highlights again. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.